These guys are following me. He's not here yet. He's he lives on Mount Zion, so it's gonna take a minute to get here. I called about half called about twenty minutes ago. He should be here any minute now. You don't need to worry about me. I if I wanted to whoop you, I really could. My car is right over here. You can follow me all you want. I got you on camera. If you something stupid, it's gonna I got a big channel coming up. You can follow me all you want, you can do whatever the hell you want. So I'm at the Ark, and I probably posted videos already. If not, they definitely should be up by now. I got the pet wallaby. Hey, there we are. And I went on that. So they got little buses that take you to the to the parking lot and to the thing to, to the actual exhibit. And so the guy was like, "Dude, you can't be on the bus by yourself." I'm like, "You're underage." I'm like, "Okay, I'm 16." My mom said I'm loud. Look, you don't gotta worry about me. Safety numbers, my little children. So he kept following me around the bus. The dude kept looking. The driver kept looking at me like I'm I'm stupid. So I said to him, "Where's your family at?" So he said to me, "Where's your family at?" I said, it, "That is not your business to know where my family's at." And I said, "Just just leave me alone. You're not my boss, and I'm not gonna talk to you until you do something stupid." I'm just gonna go walk down there. I don't care. I got all my stuff. And um, he kept saying that I'm underage. And what's very funny is that I, w I got tired, so I hopped on a bus. I was the only person, ooh, the, the Vermont plate. That's cool on that 350. And I went down there all by myself, all the way down to my car to take a nice nap. And the guy, was, he didn't say anything to me. He said nothing to me. He didn't care, but that guy, he was like, okay, where's your family? I said, my family's up, uh, up at the York. They're about to listen to a concert. So I'm, I'm like, okay, um, I'm just sitting here waiting for my grandpa to show up, which it shouldn't be that hard. So he's like, where, where, where's your family at? I'm like, I'm fine. I've been on the bus four times already. I was actually on the bus by myself today. I'm the only kid on here. But he, he still had to drive me down there because he had like 20 other freaking people on there. I'm just going to sit down right here. Um, so I jumped on the bus and right when I got off, he had one of the guards. I think it was one of the guards, I think. And I was, and you heard me cursing at him like I'm fucking stupid. Um, I'm like, okay, I'm not, I'm, uh, you, you're not my dad. You never will be. My dad's dead, which very much miss him. Oh, we got to guard ourselves. You need something from me? I'm just waiting for my grandfather, sir. Yes, he's in a blue um, camera for my safety and your safety as well. Okay, that's fine. I'm just don't want to get hurt or anything. No, no. He's. I, 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 I get you trying to. Trying to make sure you're doing okay. I'm fine, sir. I'm. Okay. Were you visiting the ark today? Yes, I was. Okay. I just got real tired. I'm getting. That's why I'm a little aggressive. I'm just real tired. I just called him. He lives on Mount Zion Road. He's coming his way. He's on his way right now, actually. Oh, did he drop you off here? No, my mom's brought me here she's up there somewhere at, at the bfa concert and i'm just literally waiting for him so he doesn't have to pay here because okay. he's just literally picking me up and we're gonna go on okay that is literally it okay you, listen you're, you're fine to wait for him out i'm here? 16 years old i'm yeah, not you're, 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 i get i get that they're worried about me i'm just i don't i'm usually not this aggressive yeah. i get you're trying to keep me safe but i'm just Tired, sir. I really am. Okay. Well, listen. You're fine and wait out here. You're also welcome. We have shade over there. You're welcome to sit on the bench and sit down. And wait for him. It's up to I you. I appreciate okay? it. I appreciate it, sir. Okay. Yes. You, you wait out here. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you. I'm just easy. Okay. You, you have a good one. Just wait for him now. <laughs> Mom's not gonna like this. Let's call him now, actually. So, yeah, long story short, the driver is like, where's your family at? So I said, 
I'm fine, sir. I am actually quite happy. I kept saying, don't worry about it, I'll be fine. I sat down next to a group of people with their kids and other bunch of people, just safety numbers. Like if someone were to, I don't think many people are gonna go after a 16 year old boy. So I'm not saying they definitely exist. Okay, around 17%, we're fine. My guard, I, I knew, I had a feeling somebody was gonna follow me. There he goes. So he kept saying, where's family at? Where's family at? Like, it's okay. So eventually, when he wasn't looking, I jumped on the bus. He knew I was on the bus. So he did, He had to drive me because there was a bunch of other people down there waiting for it. So I jumped out. There was, that's one of the, that's one of the little cops there, here. He's just a guard. But I think another employee was just worried. He kept saying, hey, you, you, you're underage. I'm like, yeah, everyone else is. I've seen other kids by themselves, so. I don't see why the problem is. I mean, yeah, I, get, I, I was really, I try to be, I am really am tired, you guys, and I'm, I'm trying to be nice to the people that haven't start shooting me already. I am literally just waiting for my grandpa. I mean, I'll definitely see him come from, um, thing this way and then go circle in this way and then yeah I'll, I'll, that's why I'm waiting here because I know he's going to circle through this way I told him what kind of car he has just to kind of be a little more honest I, I can deal with police you guys you saw me deal with the police before when I went on top of the underneath the overpass and I kept screaming real loud to scare people and everything more of a social experiment but yeah it's an old one from like October of 2020 and I dealt with the cops, I had to turn a lot of, I had to cut out a lot of that just for everything. I told straight away, I'm recording for my safety and your safety, so, so you can't do something to me and lie about it, and I do it vice versa. So yeah, peace.